A cornerstone of downtown Green Bay development continues. Associated Bank Corp moving its headquarters and hundreds of workers downtown and planning for the possibility of future growth. Right now, they say the focus is on renovations, and they're doing that at the Regency Building in downtown Green Bay. The bank's current headquarters is in Ashwaubenon. So just how many employees are going to be making the move to downtown and how many more jobs could be coming? Fox 11's Bill Miston has the story. Associated bank officials say as they're designing their new headquarters, they're thinking about the future, specifically how to keep and attract new employees. No one element makes that happen. The job, security of that organization, the pay, the way the, 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 the space feels. This was one piece of that equation that we can provide an environment that based on research nationally says this is where the next generation desires from an attribute standpoint regarding the physical structure of the space. That means more open spaces, lots of natural light, places to go like a planned first floor cafe and places for collaboration away from desk life. Most of the, all the structural elements are already complete. Construction will run about eight months total and we are on time and on budget. From framing to drywall to ceilings, Associated Bank Construction Project Manager Anthony Farrow says the project is about 70% done. What's left, Farrow says, is mostly cosmetic, office furniture, carpet, and paint. Associated Bank wouldn't say how much money was going into the project and would only show us the fourth floor, saying the other floors weren't ready to be seen. When it's all said and done here at 433 Main, more than 400 employees will move from six locations two of which it owns, four it leases to the renovated Regency. But none of them will be brand new jobs. But there will be room for growth of up to 630. I don't think we're going to grow to 600 colleagues in the next two years. So, But yes, if that growth would occur, it would be through new jobs. Bank officials say they hope the consolidation process will be done by July. In Green Bay, Bill Miston, Fox 11 News. As for the two other downtown offices the bank currently owns, officials say they are looking to sell one of those. The others, officials say they're going to be keeping and repurposing.